All right, so I had mentioned before that uh, the front triangle has a couple mechanics on it that have changed and evolved over the years. And it's something that I noticed myself where up until about Purple Belt, I was having great success with the triangle that I just showed. However, when I started going against like really super athletes, UFC fighters, and uh, a lot of brown and black belts, Alberto, if you put me in a front triangle, uh, it started really becoming difficult for me to finish this because people realize that you need this arm across the body to trap it in this way and start to go for the strangle. So what they would do a lot of times is early on, they would bring the hand to this side of the body. And this caused me major problems where they would hide this arm. It wouldn't exactly be in an opposite side triangle. And uh, they would go with different methods like they would trap the hip and then they would replace the other hand and then they would start to look to escape and they had all different ways of being able to thwart my triangle and especially like these tough UFC fighter guys man part of the strangle of the triangle here is this leg is strangling my carotid artery on this side and their other leg is sending my shoulder into my carotid artery on the other side so these guys with really, really broad and big shoulders that were super strong were able to put a thumb post in my leg and they would be able to survive because I didn't have the strength, even my legs, to um, be able to manipulate this shoulder into their neck, okay? So the, the triangle needed to evolve over the years to accommodate for these higher level guys that were defending the triangle in this way. Okay, one of the strongest methods, in my opinion, of doing this, Alberto, if you go head facing the wall over here, is locking an ankle triangle. Okay, laying down, that works. So, we're here. Let's say I'm in an arm bar scenario and I have this leg over here. I'm going to use the uh, Kimura nature of the arm lock here and I'm going to raise. Alberto's head off the floor. I could even use my knee to help me from here, okay? And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lock my ankle right next to his neck. And from here, I'm able to lock my feet together. From here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna control the other arm, and when I pull this other arm to me, this becomes an extremely tight strangle that I've eliminated the shoulder in this way and I've changed the nature of my strangulation leg, where now I'm plugging the artery with my ankle rather than with my hamstring. And the same problem of the shoulder doesn't come up as often. So a couple of different ways you, know, you could do this, you could grab your ankle like this, and this is a front triangle variation. This isn't a back triangle. This is a front triangle, but I'm locking an ankle triangle, where I go here and I grab the second arm, and I'm able to extend and get the finish from here, okay? Another method of how the front triangle has evolved over the years is if I'm here and they're doing annoying maneuvers like taking this arm and bringing it to this side, um, this makes it difficult for me to get his shoulder into his neck, okay? so. Even if the hand's like here a lot of times, this is what they would do often because it's not an opposite side triangle and it's not exactly um, a front triangle either. It's right in the middle. It's so annoying. So instead of locking where my knee is so high up above his ear, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a better angle where my knee is going to be below his ear in this way. And once my knee is below his ear, now when both of my legs go in this direction and I go to lock the triangle over my, almost my calf instead of my knee from here, now I've eliminated his shoulder from the strangle. And now when I squeeze my legs, it's an extremely tight stranglehold. So the triangle evolves from only being able to be finished when the arm was across the body in this way and my knee was up high okay and I got a lot of finishes up here until purple belt and then this stopped working because guys started defending this earlier and earlier so we need to make adjustments where 
we put our knee below his ear and I have my legs going in the same direction and I lock up from here. And then now I could finish this when I eliminate his shoulder and his arm is in my armpit. So use all of the different methods of the triangle, the new updated versions of the front triangle to get your finishes and your finishing mechanics even better to finish everyone from white to black belt.